Hi guys, Gilliam Elliott here with an educational video about medical tourism. Today I'm going to do an email response video and it's going to be short. It's a question that I got from a person that's interested in our course. And the reason why I want to do more of these email response videos is because if you guys have similar questions, hopefully these videos can answer those questions for you. So I'm going to read the email that they sent to me. Now I am going to leave out their name and other details about them, but I do just want to get this question answered on camera so you guys can hear it and hopefully take something away from it. So the email starts out with, hi Gilliam, I've been following you on YouTube for some time now and I'm in the process of starting my medical tourism company. I want to take the course, but I'm concerned about taking it in English because I'm not a strong English speaker. What other language do you have the course in? Okay, so before I answer the question, I do just want to say this first. Um, people from all around the world have taken our Certified Medical Travel Agent certification, and it's been people who speak basic English all the way, obviously, to people who speak great English. But the course is not made to be complex as far as language. It's not made to be like a bunch of definitions. It's made so you can understand how to start a medical tourism company from scratch, from the ground up. So it takes you through the whole process of building this company and every step through the process, but it's not made to be complex and it's not complex. It's easy to follow. Each module is very straightforward and at the end of each module, it has a quiz and then at the end you have a final exam. But it wasn't made to be a hard course. It was made to be an educational course and that's exactly what it is. It wasn't made to be an extremely hard course. It's made to convey to you how to set up your company. And that's exactly what it does. And it does that in very simple and basic language that anybody can understand. And the information in the course is presented in different formats. What I mean by that is there's videos in the course, there's charts, there's graphs, there's infographics. We use an array. We use so many different ways to communicate to you the message of how to set up this company and how to convey to you different concepts of medical tourism and different ways to set up your business and different business models. So we have the course in English and we have it in Spanish and we're working on other languages as well. But English and Spanish is what we have right now. But if you understand how to speak basic English and how to comprehend basic English, you're going to have no problems with this exam because it's really made to be easy to follow and convey to you how to set up a company. It's not really complex. It's really just educational. And that's what we stuck to. We stuck to making it very educational and very informative and it's not complex. But I hope this answers you guys questions. If you have questions about uh, what languages we have the course in or how hard it is to take or if it's easy to follow or if it's hard. Um, this this should answer that question. But if you guys have any other questions about the certification, I'm going to leave my contact information below as well as a link to the certification program. But thank you guys for watching. I look forward to seeing you in the next video.